Hello, my name is Philip Sharp, and I'd like to talk to you about First Baptist Church Midwest City and how God used that as a tool to influence my life and bring me to Christ and bring me into the ministry. I started going to First Baptist Church when I was in junior high, and that's when my dad, he dragged me there and my stepmom. And there, that's where I saw my dad get saved and baptized. And, and from there, God brought people within that church around me and I learned to respect them and listen to them. And one of those people was a dentist. And when I graduated from high school, this dentist came by my house as a graduation gift and gave me a small Bible. And through that Bible, he gave me the plan of salvation. And then that's all he did. He just handed it to me. Well, from there, two years later, God used that encounter to bring me to Christ. And so, and then that's when I started really going to Sunday school and being involved in church and from there God led me to help in the ministry of the church our youth our music minister asked me one day to help him with the uh, Christmas play the Christmas um, program and at first I said no and then I felt bad about that and I told God if he asks me again I'll say yes and he did and so I started getting in involved in the church that way by helping with programs and helping with stuff like that which helped um, bring the message and from there I taught Sunday school in the youth department and God helped me learn to teach and prepare a lesson and then from there I was able to work full-time at the church as a custodian and operating the sound and doing all kinds of ministry jobs and at that church, we, I had a great youth minister that helped me, a great music teacher minister that helped me, and our pastor helped me. And our pastor started allowing me to teach Sunday nights and Wednesday nights when he wasn't available. And from there, I grew in Christ and learning and um, teaching people about God. And then one day, God brought my wife to that church as the organist. And then I went down one morning and proposed to her in front of the church at her organ. And then God brought me a wife to that church. And then we had a child named Andrew. And he got to grow up in that church his first seven years. And then from that, God led me to... Heavenly Heights Baptist Church, where I'm a pastor there today. And I could not have done that if it wasn't for First Baptist Church, Midwest City.